Hello there, I'm Ryan Murray and I'm a professor at Towson University's Electronic Media and Film Department. I'm going to show you in this series of tutorials how to make your first VR escape room in Unity. If you're in my actual class at Towson, you might be thinking, I already know who you are, but I thought maybe I'd leave these public on YouTube so they could be helpful for other people who aren't in my class. Um, so let me show you the end result kind of demo of where we're going uh, to show you the skills we're going to be learning using um, Unity and the XR Interaction Toolkit. I also want to point out that um, in my classroom we work on Macs. So in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to develop a VR project without um, some of the conveniences of a PC, um, which include just hitting play and being able to be immediately in headset. Uh, so I'm recording on a PC right now, but at school we, uh, we do Max, and I will make sure to show you how uh, to develop this kind of thing on a Mac too. Okay, so here we are in headset. Um, I've created uh, a simple world using some free assets and lots of um, simple cubes. I can move either through a, a joystick motion or through um, teleporting. And when I enter these doors, I'm locked in. Some doors have appeared and lights have turned on. But over here, there appears to be a button. Let me see what happens when I touch it. Aha. And if I grab this. Look, I think I'm supposed to put it over here. Whoa, cool. And one final button. All right. So, world's simplest escape room perhaps, but this is going to teach us all the principles um, of, uh, of basic usage of the XR Interaction Toolkit. We will learn to um, touch things, grab things, socket them into uh, um, sort of keyholes, so to speak, and um, all those interactions can trigger events in Unity like uh, sounds lights, videos, and um, opening doors. So with the rest of this tutorial series, I will show you how I uh, set up a VR project in Unity and how I made all this stuff happen.